Our first pair this week were a couple of good mates who just happened to share black belts and they know all about hard training, folks. First up is Big Mick Wilson. Big Mick is a Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu master holding a black belt in multiple state, national and pan-Pacific titles in the discipline. A gentle giant, believe me when I tell you, the only place you don't ever want to meet this bloke is across the map. Training with him today is James Tomlinson. James also holds a black belt, but in Taekwondo, where he was the 2006 and 2007 national champion. He's a qualified kettlebell instructor and is no slouch when it comes to BJJ either, folks, as he's the current Victorian novice champion in his weight division. Today they smash us through a gruelling kettlebell workout, so let's check it out. The workout we're going to do today is the double kettlebells 300 workout, and uh, yeah, it's very challenging, deceptively challenging actually. It's called the 300 workout because it's 300 repetitions throughout the whole workout. We're going to do a series of kettlebell exercises, including a whole large number of kettlebell moves including swings, snatches, presses, alternating cleans, things like that. From a fitness perspective this is a conditioning workout so it is mainly based to increase your cardiovascular endurance, but it's also very good for uh, increasing localised endurance in the, in the major muscles. So uh, we would probably do this workout once a week, but we do conditioning workouts three or four times a week. This is just one of them. Keep going, keep continuous and find a rhythm because we've still got three sets to go. <laughs> it gets harder from here because we start to include more dynamic movements. Each set gets progressively harder. Uh, basically, it's really there to test you. <laughs> Your, uh, your mental strength. So even when you're getting physically tired, even though the bells aren't particularly heavy, the lactate's building up, the heart rate's climbing up, there's not much recovery time there. It's only three, three and a half minutes. And you'll get straight back in and do something more dynamic, more challenging on your stability. And when you're a beginner, you just start off light so that you can complete the number of repetitions. And sometimes if you're quite unfit, you've got to take a little bit longer to rest up in between sets, but ideally, minimum rest Maximum work. That's a lot harder for him to stabilize. He's got to use his shoulder, his grip, and all stability through his shoulders to stay in that position, this is very challenging. Starting to now. <laughs> this is not your standard weights routine because it's mainly focusing on using your posterior chain muscles, so your hamstrings, your glutes and your lower back while also focusing on your grip and really getting your heart rate up. So, because you want to do the workout in the shortest amount of time, it really ups your lactate as well, so it's very hard on your whole body. Now we're incorporating kind of alternating movements, left and right, which means there's a lot more repetitions. You can adjust the weight so it's manageable, but I would think you want to aim to take about five minutes per per set. So you can slip over that a little bit. For, for actual workout time, it's probably something like 20 to 25 minutes would be preferable. And then if it gets too easy, then obviously step the weight up to the next weight and then build it from there.
toughest of the lot. There's a lot of lunges in this one. This jiu-jitsu workout, you've got to move your body in certain ways. It's not just like running or riding a bike. So to condition yourself for jiu-jitsu fitness, you've got to incorporate a whole lot of different movements and this can help strengthen parts of the body that are useful for jiu-jitsu. Nearly over. There's only a big set of overhead lunges to go and then bear crawls. So fatigue is exceptionally high. You gotta work continuously, keep your heart rate up, using all your muscles. Everything, core, grip, shoulders, heart, lungs, legs, glutes, back, calves. Really functional workout. Definitely. Yeah, all over. Workout. Good. Work yeah.